Hey guys, so uh, I've been having problem with uh, this tree because it's been pouring down tons of sap on my windshield and, and the front hood. The body itself doesn't really bother me if sap falls on it. I don't care about that. It's no big deal. It got to wrap anyway, so I'm good. It's the windshield because once that sap hardens and it gets extremely hard to get rid of and on top of that, when I'm... Uh, when I'm in a real dire situation where I need to, you know, like a thunderstorm or whatever, the wipers, they, they just get damaged and they don't clean out the windshield. And then I'm really in trouble. So anyways, long story short is, what I chose to do is, uh, I got myself a, a wrap. I was trying to find something for the windshield itself, but I couldn't. So I went to AutoZone and I purchased this. And I'll show you how it looks like after I install it it's it's easy but it's tedious i ain't fun to lie it is tedious it's a pain in the ass sometimes but you know you have to take certain measures to get a certain result you know what i'm saying um but i'll show you in a second all right here we go so as you can see tons of sap has already fallen see right here you see more look at that all of that is sap that would have fallen on my car and it sucks another thing i forgot to tell you i've been using this uh the blue bar the clay bar to get rid of a lot of the sap on the windshield um as you can see i've been using it extensively um yeah i'm pressing the hell out of it anyway yeah, but this is what I've been using. I got two bars off of eBay. Uh, total that I spent was, I think it was $12 for both. So it's pretty good, man. I, it, it helps, but you also need like a razor blade. Um, I saw online that they said you can use nail, uh, nail polish remover. I, I didn't try it. I don't know if I want to try it. Maybe, I don't know. I'll try it on a on a separate glass or something just to see just in case because I, I i feel that the nail polish remover will will make the glass smoky like ash it out or something i don't know but i have to try it out um but yeah this is what i've been using all right there you go yeah i know you're asking like why don't you just cover the whole thing well simply because i'm lazy I don't want to. I just need for it to cover the front so that when the sap falls down, it never hits the windshield. Um, you also might be asking, why don't you just get yourself something for the windshield at AutoZone? Well, I did. I also tried uh, O'Reilly's. Um, I also looked online and I couldn't find anything. Unless you guys have any details, any, any, uh, tips I, I gladly welcome it but uh, and since it was an emergency last minute I was seeing a ton of sap I was just like urgent I, I just needed something to cover it, just the immediate aftermath so yeah I covered it up it's waterproof heavy duty cost me a hundred expensive I get it but it gets the job done um, for now Hopefully, if I can find something better, much easier, where I don't have to be taking this off, putting it back on every single time I go out, hopefully I can find something like that.